everyone welcome back to my channel in today's video i'm going to create this look for new year eve and yes if you're new to my channel then please take a moment and subscribe to my channel and don't forget to hit the bell icon so that whenever i will come up with new content you will get the notification now without further ado let's get started So yes guys, I am here with my bare skin. I already cleansed my skin and applied moisturizer and my skin is totally prepped before applying the makeup. So it's very important guys that makeup apply karne se pehle skin prep karna and uh, I'm going to use today a primer from the Sugar. So yes, I Sugar se ye primer use kar rahi hu. primer hai. I love it. It easily get absorbed into my skin hardly takes few seconds not more than that i will mention the link in the description below after uh, applying the primer i'm moving towards the foundation so for the foundation i'm going to use this one from maybelline and i'm in the shade 130 uh if i'm not wrong buff beige now what i love about this foundation is this may already pump hair so I don't do uh, I don't have to add a separate pump and uh, to blend the uh, foundation I'm going to use a damn beauty blender because I really do need a dewy finish and not a dry look uh, moreover a uh, video may thoda sa white dikh raha hoga aapko it's because of a bright sunlight so please bear with me uh, it just matches my skin tone after few minutes it just get oxygen so yes, if uh, your skin tone is getting from my skin, so you can go for this shade. Uh, it will absolutely go perfect. And here I am taking a little bit. Don't forget to apply foundation on your neck as well. So that you don't have to apply it on your face and after that it will look like a mask. No, I don't, we don't need that, right girls? So yes, that's why. I will always suggest that foundation face may be apply karna hai or neck may be apply karna hai and bohot time leke blend karna hai and as you can see maine eye area ko bare rakha hai because I am going to apply the concealer from Makeup Revolution London I am in the shade C10 uh, again once again I would like to mention link I will mention in the description below so don't forget to check that out I'm blending the found uh, sorry <laughs> I'm blending the concealer using the damn beauty blender again if you want, you can blend the concealer brush with concealer I personally love this concealer and it's one of my favorite concealer in the year 2020 so I'm going to highly recommend to you guys please go for it uh, it's not very expensive uh, it's a, like uh, within 1000 it will uh, it's a price hai. okay after blending the concealer i'm going to set it and bake it using loose powder from fit me i personally loved it usually my brush ke mother se apply karti hu, but today i'm going to apply the loose powder using the blender and i'm going to keep it for approx 10 minutes yeah approx 10 minutes after then that i'm taking a brush or my loose powder ko halki se apne eyelid mein apply kar rahi hu taki koi crease create na ho jaye aur ek smooth base ban jaye now it's time for eyebrows so yes guys you know how much i love to do eyebrows and for that i am going to use this one from etude house uh, this is a really inexpensive eyebrow pencil uh, nika may bohot easily available hai and i'm going to highly recommend it to you guys agar aap beginner ho go for it you will personally love it and as you can see i'm filling it up using the pencil and uske paas puli ke madad se brush kar rahi hu and Yes, you can see that I am having a nice eyebrow finish. And Mira and I already bake ho chuka hai, so I am going to remove it with the help of a brush. And after removing the loose powder, guys, you can see that Mira jo under eye area hai is looking really bright, and there is no hint of any dark circles. All right, now moving to the eyeshadow palette. For today, I'm going to use the basic one from Wet n Wild. It is really inexpensive, and I'm going to take this transition shade. And I apply it in my eyelid area. Mein apply kar rahi hu, kafi halke se, and kafi smoothly, I'm blending this out. These shades are really pigmented, so make sure, guys, that you take at a time. Lijega. Don't take a lot of color at one time. 
and after blending the transition shade properly all over the eyelid area i am going to take this dark brown shade and isko main apne outer corner mein apply karungi now main kaise isko apply karungi that is i am going to show you i am taking this cute little tube from mac ye mujhe actually free mein mila tha from mintra and uh, main isko thick aise place kar rahi hu so that i will get a sharp cat eye finish without using any sort of cello tape or a concealer after applying the eye shadow just look at it guys kitni achhi tarike se ye cat eye finish hota hai just a big tube isko aise place kijiye and apply the eye shadow it looks amazing and now i'm going to blend the eye shadow using a fluffy brush a clean brush ke madad se main isko achhi tarike se blend taki koi harsh line na rahe and as you can see that i'm done with my upper eyelid eye shadow now moving to the another eye shadow palette which i'm going to use today this one is from makeup revolution petrica bright and i'm taking this sweet green shade and with the help of a flat eye shadow brush i am applying it on my lower lash line main koi kajal apply nahi karungi i am using this green eye shadow to give it a very vibrant holiday uh, vibes uh, it is looking absolutely gorgeous and anyone can pull this combination pull this color and now moving to the bronzer i am using this one from sugar and the shade i will mention in the description below So for this look I'm going to use bronzer and not contour. Okay, I really love this formula. It's very smooth, it's very soft and uh, ye fair complexion mein kafi zyada acha lag raha hai. Um though I'm not sure about dusky or medium skin tone, but yeah, it will go great for fair skin tone, fair to medium. All right, main forehead pe ka bronze kar rahi hu and saath mein cheeks and apna jaw line. and after bronzing i will move to the blush and for the blush i'm going to use uh, this one from wet and wild i really like this uh, this one does have a very peachy tone and it gives a very subtle and uh, glowy look which i personally love After applying the blush, I'm going to move towards the highlighter. For highlighter today, I'm going to use this one from Maybelline Master Chrome in the shade Molten Gold. I personally love this. Drug store me. Agar highlighter ki baat kara jaye, to sabse acha Maybelline and Wet n Wild ka hota hai. So yes, guys, I'm really going to recommend this one. I'm applying the highlighter on my high points like my cheekbones, my nose, my chin area. Also I'm taking an eye shadow brush and applying it on my cupid bow, inner corner of my eyes and my brow bone. And now I'm going to take this white eye pencil from Maybelline and applying it on my lower waterline area to give it a very bright look. a bright finish Now I'm moving towards the mascara for mascara today I'm going to use uh, this one from L'Oreal as you know guys that this particular mascara really hit the Indian market and ye bhi sach hai ki ye eyelashes ko bahut hi behtareen tarike se define karta hai but one more thing guys I would like to say that ye waterproof mascara hai uh, isko agar normally aap baby oil se ya kisi cleansing mil se aap remove karna chaho to it is really hard and difficult to remove it so ye mascara remove karne ke liye aap waterproof miscellaneous water use kar sakte ho and that will be really really great now you can see that ye mascara kitne khoobsurat tarike se mere eyelashes ko define kiya hai agar main falsy na lagao tab bhi chalega all right now moving to the lip liner for lip liner i'm going to use the classic ruby woo lip liner from mac 
दिस इज़ अ वेरी फाइन शेड ऑफकोर्स सबको पता है कि ये शेड मैक का सबसे ज़्यादा फेमस है and as uh, i already mentioned in the title that it will be a classic red lip makeup tutorial so so for that reason i decided to define my lip now moving to the lipstick i'm going to use this one from mac powder kiss liquid lipstick range i simply love the formula the formula is really soft smooth and smudge proof and uh, it gives a very 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 fine finish i think mac ke jitne sare lipstick ke range hai sir usme se powder kiss range is my favorite one now i'm almost done and now last but not the least i'm going to use this setting spray from mac fix plus uh, this is the pink light one with this glitter particles i love it but yes you can also opt for the original one and it really melt my makeup just look at it it gives a nice finish so yeah uh, if you want to spend on a good setting spray then you can spend on it now i just forgot that uh, i missed uh, to apply the mascara on my lower lashes so wo main abhi karne wali hu and after applying the mascara on my lower lashes i am ready and this is the final look for my new year eve party and uh, if you create or recreate this look then please tag me in your instagram stories you can follow me in my instagram twitter or my facebook page mai sare ke sare link description mein mention kar dungi so yes don't forget to check that out once again and if you really enjoy this video and like this makeup tutorial then don't forget to like and subscribe my channel and hit the bell icon so that whenever i will come up with new content aapko notification mil jayega moreover guys one more thing I wish you a very 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 happy new year in advance.